Julius the Judas Agu. Yeah, well, uh, ladies and gentlemen, it's nice to be here with you all. Please a big round of applause for all of our web party tickets. Even those people where people buy for, please take clap for yourself. You feel like it was the guy for nine million bucks, yeah, yeah, usually nine million plenty bucks. You know, people, it's um, it, it's not cool to watch shows alone. So usually when you go to concerts, you you buy and you buy for that special someone. So you have company, you know, somebody to laugh with, you know, somebody to gossip with. You know, just as a day, maybe show never start to kind of gossip, you know, with your friend. You know, I, I, the gossip part begin before a show is usually the fun part. You know, sometimes you go to weddings, you arrive there too early, nothing has started, you're bored, so you begin to gossip. You know, guys, we do it a lot. But no, men don't gossip, we discuss. <laughs> so, well, I, I don't fear just that I, I forgot. Yes. We discuss. We discuss, we don't gossip. So, very, so yeah, so yeah, like, you know, maybe AY and I, we arrive at an event early and we're just, you know, discussing. Usually we discuss money or women. Yeah, so. But for wedding, now seems to be money matter, so we just discuss women. Uh, so, you know, we are there waiting for guests to arrive and we are discussing the women. Most times it will be like analysis. So I was at this event and these two men came in early and they were discussing women. You know how the women gradually begin to stray into the venue, so we are analyzing. Like I said, we don't gossip. We are analyzing the babes. You know, so as they come in, ah, they don't see babe. I see this babe. This one completes. I'm so babe, so both babe. She's like the first national bank with all the deposits in the right places. <laughs> yeah, that's why I'm saying another one going to ah, it says this one shape, babe, this one no makeup. <laughs> the shape just be like half space, toothpaste. <laughs> it's just do more posting down. Yeah, that's why the shape. We have the basic now discussion, 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 discussion going on. So we are just they are analyzing. Now these two men we are you know gossiping. This woman walked in. This guy comes out and said, ah! Can the woman be this ugly? This woman, for all I say, like career. Now, guess what? You know, you're coming in, as you're approaching the guys, the features are becoming more distinct and clearer. So the guy, they won't see more weaknesses and flaws. You know? Now, the guy he was talking with at this point was quiet. But this guy just carry on. This kind of woman can gossip. You see these people wear ugly like this, they can be very wicked. <laughs> see, 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 as he comes as I cannot go see the neck. See, that's bleaching, burn the face. She be like burnt on her. The man who they talk, the woman just they call the cops. Ah, oh, man, see the, see the K leg. The enemy be like, okay, but I see yourself. <laughs> then finally, bah, the woman comes to the table where they can sit down. As a guy chair, like, why would they go sit to meet my wife? Hi, my name is Julius the Genius Agua. I want to take you down memory lane. If you remember this, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. That's exactly what I wanted to do this summer. As we stomp the UK and of course Republic of Ireland, we crack your ribs on 13th August. Yes, it's happening at Carlton Hotel. Church Road, Tyrellstown, Dublin 15, Republic of Ireland. Crack your ribs! And then the train moves on to Aberdeen on 21st of August. Aberdeen Exhibition Centre, that's the venue. So tell somebody, because from there we're moving to London. This is the 11th edition of Crack Your Ribs in London, Eve of Notting Hill Carnival, 28th August. Yes, it's taking place at Lighthouse Hall. Follow me at Julius Ago 1. You better go get your tickets now or run out. Okay, maybe we'll see for cracker ribs. See you all there. Crack your ribs! Julius the Judas, I do. Ladies and gentlemen, 
the last 10 years, this our brother has been doing this a lot. And I think he deserves a standing ovation. Mr. DJ, let's go! I don't want to go into these stories, I don't want to go in. But I just realized 
a lot of things happened and I experienced a lot, especially when that thing happened. You know, first I have this memory loss. I see my wife, I pass her. <laughs> I say, imagine that kind of thing happened. Maybe as you lost the memory, and all your old girlfriends on a flash for me. I don't know. Okay, where are you? You feel you won't talk to your wife. You said the judge can. <laughs> but you know, after the surgery, um, a lot of people in fact have uh, opinion I shouldn't really share. Say it's too Are you sure you're strong enough to come climb on stage and do this? I just said I needed to do this to tell God thank you. And to shame them. We've been doing this in London. We've been doing it in Nigeria for over 15 years. But we said we must celebrate 10 years and also recognize those who have supported us. Even with all the hurdles, all the challenges. Part of the hurdles, I said, I still learn like how to work out well now. My wife is somewhere there, but she said I shouldn't say it because I was saying it. After the surgery, she gave back from I don't realize that some of these things take you back to when you were a baby. So no good chair, she no good chair, I'm causing her for chess. Go the bathroom. No be your show, no be jazz. Okwa chi ni ni. Lele, o si na chi. Kam no kwa, o si na chuku. Mwane madu, o si na chi mo. Everybody si na chi. Hey yo, what up? See your boy Amber Smith, Osinachi, one of Africa, and this is public announcement. Don't miss out. Crack your ribs. I mean, crack your ribs. You know, crack your ribs. It's happening live. Watch out the dates. On the 13th of August, Dublin, turn up. Don't miss out. I say so. On the 21st of August, Aberdeen, don't miss out. It's going to be fun. It's going to be dope. And on the 28th of August, the mother of all shows, London. Turn up, Lagos to London. It's gonna be fun. Julius, the genius, Agu, is gonna be live with you and humble Smith. Julius, the genius, Agu. Fantastic, man. Good to see you guys. How are you doing? So, you're right, yeah? Yeah, I guess I can take me chat. <laughs> so, ladies and gentlemen, um, um, I'm not going to be here for no one going on the show later on, but I'm happy to be here. Give a round of applause to Julius and the rest of the comedians as well for having me. I appreciate you guys. Uh, black parents in the house, make some noise. Your parent makes some noise. Yeah, yeah, be quiet. We are not celebrating. I'm not for you issues, black people, okay? We have to allow our children to pay. Some of you have never heard of what I'm talking about. What they 
can't see another child do it. <laughs> my mom saw Michael Murphy tearing up the house. She said, Could you come here, come here. If you ever, in your life! <laughs> I'm walking around with Michael Murphy's bruises. <laughs> These ain't jokes, I've got problems. Problems in my life. Do you have any Jehovah's Witness in the house? Yeah, let's talk about them. <laughs> let's talk about them for five minutes because they give me all of their Saturdays. They get all of them. Nothing to do with the religion. The religion's cool. But I could not be Jehovah's Witness because I know when to give up. <laughs> they will come to your house. Everybody, it's your favorite comedian. My name is Bucci, and of course, we're coming through for the Crack Your Ribs tour with Julius Genius Agu doubling on the 13th. You already know. How about then on the 21st? What y'all say? You don't know. You now you know. And of course, on the 28th, is going on Nothing Hill Weekend. London, Campbell will stand up. Everybody, come through. Go grab your ticket. It's Crack Your Ribs. It's life, and it's gonna be the funniest thing to hit the whole of Europe this summer. Boom, clack. In case you don't know, now you know. Bucci says it. <laughs> Julius, the genius, I do. My Nigerian people, man. I love my Nigerian people, especially my Nigerian parents. Nigerian parents in the house? Yeah. Good evening, mommies and daddies. <laughs> because you know, Nigerian parents, they are very big on respect. You have to greet them well, especially Yoruba people. I'm a kid, I'm a kid, I'm a kid, I'm a kid, I'm a I'm a kid, I'm a kid, I'm a kid, I'm a kid, I'm so please, once again, good evening, moments and daddies. I love my Nigerian parents, man, I really do. And, you know, they bring us up the right way, but sometimes they do it too much. I, they know how to confuse their children. Especially the dads. A typical Nigerian dad would call his daughter at 24. My daughter, you are 24 years old, come and sit down here. I forbid you from having a boyfriend at 24. If you ever think of having a boyfriend, and you have a boyfriend, and you get pregnant, I'll kill you, I'll kill him, and I'll kill your mother for giving birth to a prostitute. <laughs> That's at 24. The very day she got 25, my daughter, come and sit down here. My daughter, you are 25 years old, where's your husband? <laughs> come on, boyfriend, you don't have. You want to embarrass this family? Are you a gay? They know how to confuse their kids. And the mothers are the same way too. They can confuse their children. I remember growing up, my mom would always tell me, Dami, we're going to Auntie Roque's house. Make sure you don't eat anything. <laughs> I said, no problem, mom. If you know what's good for you, don't eat anything. I said, no problem, mom. We'll get to Auntie Roque's house. As soon as she opens the door, beautiful jollof rice smell. <laughs> my brain will start doing numbers. Jesus Christ, is this how I'm going to die? <laughs> I'll keep calm. I'm not going to eat. And to run care, not ask me, Dami, I made some chalo fries. Do you want some? Hey! Jesus, is this how I'm going to die? I'll now look at my mom to see if she has changed her mind and she wants to give me approval. I'll look at her, she will look at me. If you are hungry, eat. <laughs> But she won't stop there. Soon as she says that, it will be followed by the opening and closing of her eyes. You know your life is over. You know, they can confuse their kids. My dad will always tell me, that me, don't lie. If you lie, you will go to hell. If you lie, you will go to hell. I say, okay, dad, I'll try my best not to lie. One day, me and my dad were watching TV in the living room. The phone rang. I picked it up. 
Hello? Ah, Uncle Good evening. You want to talk to my daddy? To collect the money he owes you. Okay, oh, hold on, let me see if he's at home. Daddy, your uncle is asking for the money you owe him. Tell him I'm not here, tell him I'm not here. I said, Daddy boy, he said I should not lie. Really, if I slap him, tell him I'm not here. As a young boy, I carried the phone. Uncle, my daddy said I should tell you that he's not here. <laughs> what did I do wrong? Hi, my name is Julius the Genius Agua. I want to take you down memory lane. If you remember this, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. That's exactly what I want to do this summer. As we stop the UK and of course Republic of Ireland, we crack your ribs on 13th August. Yes, it's happening at Carlton Hotel, Church Road, Tyrellstown, Dublin 15, Republic of Ireland. Crack your ribs! And then the train moves on to Aberdeen on 21st of August. Aberdeen Exhibition Center, that's the venue. So tell somebody, because from there we're moving to London. This is the 11th edition of Crack Your Ribs in London, Eve of Notting Hill Carnival, 28th August. Yes, it's taking place at Lighthouse Hall. Follow me at Julius Ago One. You better go get your tickets now or pro now. Okay, maybe we'll see for Crack Your Ribs. See you all there. Julius, I do.
So, my God, just they tell me my favorite food I make. Hey, goosey. Hmm. Look at sweets. I should not mix them. You put the blood and guts. That's all the sweets. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, my people, it's very nice to be here. Oh, I want to see my English accent. Mm -hmm. My people, I help us. Make you enjoy your night, so you know, so you get many things in store for you. So, make I leave this one down. Thank you. Hi, my name is Julius, the genius I I want to take you down memory lane. If you remember this, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. That's exactly what I want to do this summer as we stop the UK and, of course, Republic of Ireland. We crack your ribs on 13th August. Yes, it's happening at Carlton Hotel, Church Road, Tyrellstown, Dublin 15, Republic of Ireland. Crack your ribs. And then the train moves on to Aberdeen on 21st of August. Aberdeen Exhibition Center. That's the venue. So tell somebody, because from there we're moving to London. This is the 11th edition of Crack Your Ribs in London, Eve of Notting Hill Carnival, 28th August. Yes, it's taking place at Lighthouse Hall. Follow me at Julius Ago 1. You better go get your tickets now or pronoun. Okay, maybe we'll see for Crack Your Ribs. See you all there.